In this video, I'm going to talk about the Veneri Cut Knife Blades. They're like needles that go into the sewing machine that will cut fabric, and there's four of them. They're color-coded. They go at 90 and 0 and at like 45 and 135 or something like that. And to work with them, I'm going to start by just creating some embroidery. So I think I'll say New and leave all my techniques turned on and say Next. Select a light colored fabric. And this time I'm just going to select a piece of artwork. I'm going to select these hearts. It's hearts JPEG that I got from the internet. And just say open and next. Now at the artwork sort of selection stage, I'm going to actually have it trace this so that I don't have to draw the hearts. So I'll let the software auto trace. Of course, it sees about 146 shapes with a bunch of different colors. And I'm just going to choose to limit the colors to two. And it'll update in a moment here. And now it sees six shapes, and they're specifically red and white. And now when I say trace, it just gives me red shapes and white shapes. So it's kind of nice and neat like that. And then I can select the white shape and just delete it. Now, if you wanted to cut this heart, or all of these hearts, as with your Venere cut knife needles, knife blades, then we would need to use our Wings Editor. This is a part that's available for Artistic Suite and Artistic Premium. You save File, and you export the design to the editor. So with the Wings Modular, this is another program. We've just exported our hearts over from the Creative Drawing software into this Wings Editor software. And so Artistic Suite comes with the basic module of Wing software. And I have some other videos that I've recorded to help you learn more about using this Wings modular um, program. Uh, but for this video, I'll specifically talk about what we need to do to convert these hearts into Venere cut steps. So I'm going to just use the simple selection tool to click on this heart to select it. And if I have it selected, I can right click over top and I say change to and I choose whoops, Venere cut. And that's it. You can see the stitches have all been removed. It still has the outline. It's marked it on the sequence manager with a little sort of cutting symbol. And it knows to put in the steps to use the four different blades. And if we look right now at File and Print, you would see, first of all, that there's no stitches in there, but there's a shape. And it shows us here that it's going to go red, then blue, then black, then green. And so when you you know save this as an embroidery design, like for me, it's Jeff. I take that to machine. It tells me, depending on which machine I have, which version, it'll either tell you the color red or it'll tell you knife blade red. Anyhow, you'll know to put in the red blade, the blue blade, the black blade, and the green blade, the knives, to cut this shape out. That's how the Veneri cut works. Now you could make, I could select more of these shapes and change them all over to be um, the Veneri cut. And you'll notice now the way I've got it, if I say file and print, you would cut one heart shape, then do it looks like a little bit of embroidery, and then going to cut another heart shape. And so if you didn't want to have to do, if you wanted it to cut all the colors simultaneously, I guess is what I'm trying to say, then you could select this heart and hold shift down to select this heart. So I've selected both of them and I'm just going to right click and say join. And by joining them together, it tells it that it's going to be, you know, done together. And that way, if I say file and print, now you'll see that I'm down to having just one set of blade sort of cuttings. Um, so that's how you can work with the Venere cut needles. And so, yeah, one more time, you have to s create the embroidery in the creative drawing software and then use file and export to editor which opens it up in the wings modular software in the basic module where you can select any shape of embroidery and right click to change to a venere cut yeah and so you can look for some other videos that I've created that'll tell you about some of the other functions, that, other reasons why you might want to use the Wings software. But that is how to create a Venere Cut design. 